I feel old, Paul. Do you? Yeah. I'm starting to feel old. Every time I go on the tube, a youngster asks if I want the seat. No. Yeah, I promise you. Yeah. That's nice, though. It's encouraging that they do that. Do you get asked if they want no, to No, because I'm quite dynamic. I get on the tube and people go, look at that man. <laughs> <laughs> man, he's, he's full of beans. Man, that man <laughs> must have eaten some hands this morning, you know. <laughs> right, come on, then. We are on the River Wensum, Robert. The Wensum used to be the country's premier roach river. There'll be a few other rivers that will probably say, well, what about... Hampshire Avon. What about me? Yeah. What about me? Hold oh, up a minute, Sam. What are you talking about? Blame <laughs> Wensum, you muppet. What about me? I'm the Hampshire Avon. What about me? <laughs> I don't know why the roach has such fascination for fishermen, but it does. And Is it tricky to catch? It, yeah, and it's pretty and delicate. What I'm doing, Bob, is giving you a glorious opportunity that very few anglers have, which is the chance to catch a specimen roach. Because, look, I'm going to try and catch a pike. Yeah. Right? I get the sense you're just, like, getting rid of me. I'm go not getting pop, rid of you pop because... pop that bit of bread in there. And... <laughs> Anything over a pound, pound, pound and a half is a good roach. Two pounds is magical. Anything above that, and I will personally arrange for your destruction. <laughs> but before... I leave you, Bob. Yeah. Let's just say you actually hook a decent fish. Oh, I see. It's a little dig at me, is it? So, you've cast your bait out, right? With it open. Whee! <laughs> Kaplop! Yeah. Now, wind the handle. Wind the handle. Well done. Slowly and gently tighten up. Slowly, gently. Just, I'm just, just slowly and gently just tightening Just enough up. to tighten up. Stop. Turn your rod round to a right angle. Turn it round. That way, 90 degrees. No, the whole of the rod. Extend the rod that way. That way? That's that, it. Yeah. There we are now. See that little bend yeah. in the quiver tip, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, you've got a knock, Bob. Oh, look, you've got a take strike. And it's coming towards you, wind in. Not really fast, slowly. Oh, look. Don't smile and look self-satisfied, <laughs> you <laughs> moron. <laughs> Go. No, I'm raise, raise the rod, raise the rod. I still think your right hand should be higher up the yes, rod. Yes, I know it should. Yeah, there, that's it. Oh, no, you haven't got the net. Oh, but this local idiot's got it. <laughs> Bob, what have you done? Yeah, I know, I've caught the biggest rod. You caught there, a bream, well done, yeah. Lovely old bream. <laughs> Here endeth your lesson, now. Right, Paul, can I show you the balletic cast? Is that wise? Puck on the lips, slightly. See that? Paul? I'm watching it in disbelief. It's fatter than ever. Look at the arch in the back, yeah? Champagne moment coming up. And then just lower the arts. Tighten your rod. And just wait for the fish to come. Hi, right, boots look foolish. <laughs> I wish you'd bugger off. So no. Bob, you don't seem very happy. What's the matter? Yeah? You, don't, you seem a bit down. Yeah, I'm a bit down, that's OK. What about if they liked or subscribed to uh, Bob and Paul's YouTube channel? Would that cheer you up a bit? Yeah, that would help a bit. A little bit, yeah. yeah. Well, there you go, then. See if you can cheer Bob up a little bit by liking and subscribing to our YouTube channel. I might even get out of bed. <laughs>